it's Sunday afternoon and as always I've been to church this morning although my life has changed very very much in recent years in terms of work direction nevertheless I'm still able to keep my church connections going and with a Sunday morning service only at Tipton Family Church that suits me down to the ground had a good service this morning, really enjoyed it. And the sermon, I like to keep them varied, interesting and topical. The sermon was about the money calm bull. I'm sure you've seen that if you're from the UK. You've seen those adverts, money company adverts on television. And there's a bull and in spite of whatever situations you see him in on the adverts, he always remains calm. The bull actually is from Uruguay. It's a two-ton bull. And I found all this out by researching the background to the adverts, because obviously there's a certain amount of money that goes in, so they have a budget. And they went to Uruguay to get this bull. So it is an actual bull that you see, although of course the scenarios that are captured in the various adverts, they're, they're different, but it's an actual bull. And if you are not familiar with the advertisements, the bull can be on an ice floe that started to crack all around him and he just stands there as calm as anything. He's on a roller coaster, calm. He's in a china shop and he's just standing there nice and calm. The Morris dancers are going all the way around him with their red flags. He's in a, a submarine situation where everything's panicky and chaos and the red lights and the emergencies going and he just stands there nice and calm. All these situations, he's on a meteor <laughs> going through the, through the uh, sky and he just stands there wagging his tail nice and gently, not even bothered or perplexed about the situation. And I think that we can learn a lot from the money calm ball in life because things don't always go well for us. We do find ourselves going through difficult situations through types of scenarios that you could actually relate to in the money calm ball adverts for example the Morris dancers with the red flags they're trying to wind him up you get that in life people try to aggravate you people try to wind you up get you going especially on social media people will come into your space to try to rile you when the ball is on one of those uh, lift contraptions that cleans the windows, the outside windows on a big skyscraper, so many stories up, the bull's on the contraption and then the wire cuts or the rope goes and the bull drops and he's dropping down to earth and he's just, just standing there, not bothered about things. And you get that in life where things don't go our way. Sometimes it becomes quite uh, nasty around us. It certainly becomes quite disturbing and unsettling but the bull keeps his calm I, I read a few scriptures this morning at church some verses from the bible and I didn't add the context to them I just read the verses as they were and Isaiah 7 says say to him be careful keep calm and don't be afraid do not lose heart then there was Judges 6 calm down don't be afraid the Lord replied, you're not going to die. Often the things we worry about, they never happen anyway. Exodus 14, 14, the Lord himself will fight for you. Just stay calm. Mark 4, and Jesus got up and rebuked the wind and said to the sea, be still. And the wind died down and he became perfectly calm. And he said to them, why are you afraid? Do you still have no faith? Psalm 107, he calmed the storm and the waves quieted down. Psalm 89, your faithfulness surrounds you. You rule over the majestic sea. When its waves surge, you calm them. Zechariah 10, the Lord will cross the sea of storms and will calm its turbulence. And I read those verses out first this morning before I said what I was talking about. And I asked, what's the common denominator what word have I used in each of those verses and a few people got that straight away it was the word calm stay calm doesn't matter what's going on around us as I've said a lot of what we worry about doesn't happen anyway and the reality is that if it's going to happen 
it'll happen whether we worry about it or not. All that worry does is that it drains us, it gets us onto a path where we lose our peace, we lose our calm. Be like the money calm ball. It's only an advert, it's a set of advertisements that appear on television where in spite of everything that's going on, the bull just stands there nice and calm. It might just be something we watch on television, but when you think about it, there's a lot that we can learn from the money calm bull.